You missed a spot by the shifter. And underneath, yeah, there you go. Get that exhaust pipe. Oh, look how pretty it is. Yeah, I'll get all that raw gasoline off the motor so it doesn't warm it up more from external burning. Actually, you're getting too carried away. <laughs> it's just a stupid Harley. It doesn't matter. <laughs> okay. We got a fuel line that's not leaking now. Yep. Let's turn the gas on. Sprays everywhere. Look at it. It's not spraying out like that like anymore it was. All right. Somebody left a fuel line on the floor now. There. It's out of the way now. Okay, now we're going to have to readjust the uh, carburetor once we get it running again. Seems really hard to start. Is there any fuel in it yet? Oh, Damn it. Runs a little better. It's running on one cylinder right now, though, if you notice. What? <laughs> it is? Yeah. One cylinder. Did you hear? Right at the end. Yeah. One cylinder. One of them. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got the carburetor semi adjusted. That screw under there is not very flat, and it's not too consistent where you put it. It might even be bent a little bit. See how it's not hitting on the flat part, it's hitting on the side? Mm -hmm. So every time the screw wobbles a little bit, it changes the idle speed a lot. <laughs> uh, you'll find a spot where you like it. All right, let's go look at the plugs, check them out, see what's going on. We're good. One so cylinder. What, what did we find on this side? This was sitting right like that. Oh, is that why it was yeah. on one cylinder? Yeah, who put those on? I, I don't know. It, I, I don't know either. There must be some vibration in that bracket there. It couldn't be that maybe this is bouncing like 100 miles an hour over here. On this custom heavy duty bracket you made under there. Hey, that's that. not custom, that's stock. Yeah, look at that. I'm sure that's not vibrating when that thing revs at all. It's a good thing I ground some clearance right there because it looks like it's making us some more. You might have to maybe put a zip tie on these, keeping it going there. All right. If it keeps doing that. I got so. While well, we're at it, let's look at the spark plug, see how it was already out. Oh, you got the extension going here. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, they're not loose like they were before. Nope, oh, it's still hot. Is it warm? Maybe. Yeah, okay. Why would it be warm? I mean, we are in Southern California. Yeah, that's why. Okay, it looks nice and black like it's had since we put it in there. Because we didn't put any new plugs in this motor. No, we did not. How's the oil look down in there? We can't even see in there. It's too dark. Oh, look at that. There's nothing in there. Nope. Abyss. It's the bottomless pit hole. All right, so it might run better now. I'm seeing we got two cylinders. Yeah. Are you gonna cross it or you gonna put it in correctly? Incorrectly. Is that spark plug warm? Yeah. Okay, let me do it for you. There you go. Let me burn you. Ah! That was hot, wasn't it? Yeah. Get out of here with that. I burn people just by what I touch them with. Don't break the plugs off. Come on, jeez. Just 
tight. One push. Yeah, over tighten the carburetor, over tighten the spark plug. I'm not gonna let you even look at that, you're gonna break it. <laughs> Alright. Let's see how much that vibrates when I start it. Which it goes all over the place. Let's have a little look. Alright. Let's see. I know we got two cylinders that might run better. have to do something about maybe the bracket here. When that sticks sideways like that, it raises the idle speed too high. Yeah, it's terrible. Yeah, it doesn't come down very much either. All right, now we get to pull this bracket off and weld it up. More Good. stuff to fix. Great. All right. So we went in, did all that, made sure that it's all good now. Now it's all shiny and brass and it looks like a million dollars. And uh, gold plated, platinum, gold, it's platinum, but it's gold plated platinum. That's right, it costs more than just straight gold. Wow, look at that. Take a little free play in the system. Alright, let's see if it starts to run. Plug board didn't fall out yet over there? Uh, no. Alright. So now that I flooded, how many kicks this time? One. I flooded it. One. Maybe two. Maybe three. Shoot ignition time? That new generator regulator down there is working good. Oh, what'd you do to it? No choke this time. Told you, leave the kicker down until it's running. When it runs backwards, it gets you. Now you know why, right? Yep. Oh yeah, that's 
nice and quiet. That's like short open drag pipes to make noise. Oh yeah. There he goes. Another happy customer. <laughs>